What's going on, Internet? Zyjix here, coming at you with another Mega Man Battle on Arc 6 video. Last time, Lan and Mega Man had to do a couple of trials, or, or more or less prelims, to become an Operator Navi for the Expo, coming later in the game. And Mega Man finally was actually first, and instead of coming dead last and just barely making, uh, just making the event, and this frickin' mic. Alright, whatever. Anyhow, we also gotta go to Greentown because we gotta frickin', um, we gotta frickin' testify against, um, Captain Blackbeard. Old schnozzle. Okay, we're going the opposite direction this time. Gosh, it is so green. Alright, so I have to... Hello? How about some flowers grown in Greentown? Enjoy not only the beauty, but also the scent. No thanks. Um... I heard some sort of special lecture is gonna start. Oh, good for you. Where's the frickin' cord out? Um, what? You don't look suspicious at all. <clears throat> wow, what a big building. This has to be the courthouse. Freeze! Um... I, what? What? Uh, did, I, did you say something? Lan Hikari, you will stop where you are. How do you know my name? You will be quiet and follow my orders. This is a command. The, why should I listen to some weirdo I don't know? I'm only doing my duty. You're not making any sense. Anyway, I've got an important trial to go to. And I won't be commanded by some suspicious guy. Let's go, Mega Man. <laughs> well, okay. Pretty weirdo. This is the first time I've been to a courthouse. I'm so nervous. Well, yeah, I kind of figured that would happen. Intruder alert! Intruder <laughs> This is the second time that freaking land gets nailed for being an intruder. Now, where have I heard that sound before? I know, it means something bad. Ah, I knew it! Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Wait a second! I was told to come here to testify. Oh, why didn't you say so? Please state your name. I'm Lan Hikari. Process in the name, Lan Hikari. Oh, hey, and actually, as suspected, you are not on the list. What? Therefore, you are a suspicious person and must be an intruder. That makes no sense. I'm pretty sure anybody can come into the courthouse. I mean, that's... There's no reason not to. I mean, there's no reason that you can't. Let's see. Greentown Ordinance number 128 states that anyone who enters the courthouse must have received a prior approval from the court. You are breaking about the above ordinance. You will now be arrested. I did. Wait, wait. Mr. Director, I called for this border sign witness. I simply forgot to enter his name into the list. Man, it seems like a lot of people forget to enter Land's name into something so that he's not an intruder. It was my mistake. I will add him to the list now. Special permission granted. Wait a minute. That is not the, the director talking. Have a nice day. Why did, seriously, why does everyone forget to add Lan's name? I mean... <sighs> I'm really sorry for the little mix up, my boy. I keep forgetting his voice. Um, what were those robots just now? If you try to enter this courthouse for permission, you'll be arrested by those punishment robots we just saw. You can get arrested for something like that? I suppose so. I uh, blah, 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 blah. I have not had my morning coffee. I suppose I should explain how Greentown came about. This town was founded on a theme of crime-free society, so rules and laws are more strictly enforced here. There's also a reason why there is so much greenery, as it ties into the town's theme. Research is still ongoing, but the best models of a crime-free town seem to include nature and their attributes. And this is why Greentown is full of nature now. Wow. But I still need the permission to, go, to get into court, right? So how can I get it? You'll need the green... You need to go to a green area 2's net cafe and get it. I was going to go get it myself to, and get it earlier. But I'm sorry, I forgot to take care of that. It's okay. I'll go get it and be right back. The fastest way to green area is through that tablet. Oh, and green area is full of trees, so please take this. Yes. Cyber Broadaxe? 
All right, be careful, and good luck, my boy. Really, I need luck just to do something as simple as that. Whatever. Subchip merchant, I can. Um, yeah, I need another unlock. I need to get that one from. Um, oh, look! Look there! Look what, what, look what we need to use. Black bomb, all right. Yeah, BMD, eight more HP memory. Sweet. Oh, great! Friggin' wonderful. But hey, guess what? We got tons of fire chips, and we got heat cross. So this should. <laughs> this should be quick work. I forget what the popcorn guy does. Or is, it, is it popcorn? Is it? Oh, doesn't matter. He's dead. Holy crap! I don't know how much. I, I seriously don't know how much damage I did to them. Looks like some. Oh, okay, whatever. What do, I, what do I need to talk to them for? What are we doing? We are studying for the bar exam to be lawyers. We call our group Lawyers in the Making. We are making our future by studying, and then the goal of our studies is to become lawyers. Are you planning on becoming a lawyer too? Uh, no, but that's not a bad thing. So then you must want to be a judge. I don't recommend trying becoming a judge. Not many people pass the judge's test. You should try and become a lawyer. We'll let you in our group. Oh, cheap. Maybe next time. So sneaking a snack isn't a crime? That makes perfect sense. No, don't jump to conclusions. If you snuck a, snuck a snack of caviar, that would be a first-class crime. Huh, I suppose you're right. Wait a second, what if the caviar was snuck as a snack and it was expired? Then the person who snuck the snack would be feel awfully sick. Then it would be a crime against the snack sneaker. Hmm, a compelling argument indeed. Okay, can I just... Did I really need to... Wow. Did I really need to... I seriously need to listen to all that. Well, there's more HP memory and... Chip Shuffle. Uh, custom Scream Shuffle Chip once. Alright. Another attack plus one. That is... Okay, we'll come back and get some of that. Get some more of that. Um... This... Okay, this is gonna get really... This will get freaking confusing really quickly. Alright, line up, get corpse. Oh, they do fire, they do fire popcorn. Alright, well, I've had, already had enough of your crap. Oh, you dick! Oh, no! Well, whatever. Wow, it was bug for eggs, well... You probably already know this, but, but the net is, is public property, so if you try to any mischief, you'll be fine. My suggestion is to forget about mischief altogether. You think? Uh, Alright, if you go down the slope and the small, uh, the small roads get tangled, kind of like a root, the roots of a tree. Oh wow, okay, now it's going to get even more confusing. Okay, I need to... Oh, i got to find my way to Area 2. Go away! Alright. Um, is that where I get to area two, maybe? I don't know. I'm real freaking sick of these guys. <laughs> okay, I, I don't know why I walked right back into that. That was really stupid. Alright, All right, I saw that warp point over there. Dang it. Oh crap. Here we go. Holy freaking crap, there's a well, at least I found BMD in the process. Wow, spreader two. What do you do? You know what? I, I don't have. I really. Okay, now I can't run. All right, fine. Up yours. Right, so. Get 
you. I don't think he, he attacks unless... It, that was stupid. Why Why did I do that? Why the heck did I do that? Just let go just as I got right in front of it. Oh. I am not a smart man. Alright, you know what? I guess I gotta look up the map here because this, this, this is getting really ridiculous. Alright guys, so I'm kind of an idiot. I was actually heading the right direction here. Um... I'm not touching law knowledge. Any question? Eh, let's see. Is from Green Town Ordinance 182. What is the punishment for hitting Mr. Frog in the head? Punishment for hitting Mr. Frog in the head? There's actually a law about that? You know the answer, Mega Man? Nope, not a clue. It looks like the green area too is just beyond this door. So what now? I guess we should look for the answer. Um. Crap. I'm gonna have to go ask them, aren't I? Well. <clears throat> And when I mean them, I meant, like, the, the, uh, lawyers. The lawyer nappies. Whatever, that should be, be fairly easy. Um, hmm? It's new. Yeah, I don't care. Uh, you changed your mind? Would you like to become a lawyer? And lawyers in the making? Yes. I forgot to mention the membership fee is a thousand zennies. Is it that much? If you think how much you'd make it as a lawyer, it's really a bargain. Okay. Oh dang it! He's gonna get that H or the. He's gonna get that uh, attack plus one. Whatever. All right. If he's just, um new member, please need, please to meet you. If you ever meet need, yeah. What happens if you hit? hit, hit, <coughs> if you hit <coughs> wow. I'm not sick or anything. This is kind of clogged up with a bunch of phlegm for some reason. What happens if you hit Mr. Frog on the head? I know, ju I just studied this. Hmm. Oh, I remember. If you hit a Mr. Frog on the head, the punishment is something that is, that is infuriating. It's true, really. The last time I hit one on the head, pun the punishment got me so mad. Um, uh... Wow, they've got some really weird punishments. So if you pick up Zenny on the ground without reporting it, you get tickled. Well, let's see. Wait, what? I wonder if you really if you really get an infuriating punishment. Right? I think maybe that is that the answer. Whatever. Uh, oh, by the way, I... Oh, wait, I guess I can't use it. So why do I have this? Why do I have the frickin'... Why do I have the axe program? Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Oh, just stay out of their view and they can't hit you. You can only move three squares ahead, so... <coughs> well, I might as well use Heat Cross. <coughs> Jeez, I don't know... Don't know what is with me. Alright, um... Well, that didn't work. Gonna move up, don't I? Yep. <clears throat> um, I think I went to the wrong panel, didn't I? Yes, I did. I need to get on this one. That one takes me up here. And I figured out how to get to that this spot over here. Huzzah! There is uh, another. Uh, mystery or un unlocked mystery data there, which I don't want because it's just Lance. It's not that great. I'll probably get it later. Um, so let me get it here. I wonder if I... Well... I don't know. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go talk to the door, see if that what I got was the answer. And in the meantime, I... W Wait, can I use this to charge up? Uh, I cannot use that to charge, uh, to use a rush attack. There we go. <clears throat> Got another little roly-poly. Um, alright, well, whatever, let's get back here. This isn't so bad once you figure out how to get through there. Um, the punishment is something that is infuriating. Got that wrong tonight. That is correct. 
You may pass. Well, all right. Thank you. All right. Um. Crap, and I'm just as lost. All right. I have to... Hello. Well, whatever. Whoops, wrong button. Oh, that could have been a triple. Yeah, what are you gonna know? You, you can't move. You can't hit me. Alright, um... around this way. Alright. Time to water the plants. Fa -la 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 -la. It's been said you can't treat uh, you can't treat plants roughly. That is a long green dream town, man. Every, I would hate to live here, but I swear I swear to God, I, you probably so much as like look at somebody the wrong way, and they you know, they freaking find you, or you're like so much as fart in public, you freaking get sent to jail. All right, um, you're dead. You're dead. I, yeah, I gotta, I gotta be doing at least a hundred and I want to say at least 140. Well, oh, that's right. I was going to the the um, heading over here. Duh. All right. Um, cross for the win. This is actually going to be uh, very, very helpful here. I was probably not as smart. Uh, that was probably not the smartest move, but whatever. I uh, don't think I can reach him. Well, yeah, I can. I guess he's there. Not quite as, as invincible as I thought. But actually, yeah, heat cross really. This is going to be really good for this area. Um, that Navio there has been has been the victim of all sorts of fraud. The lawyer tried to get the details, but apparently that Navi was more than a lawyer could handle. Oh, this is awful. Calm down. What kind of fraud are you victim to? Tell me all the details. If you don't tell me everything, I, we can't sue. I don't think this is who we need to talk to. Welcome to the Greentown Net Cafe. Courtroom entry permits? Of course, you can apply for those here. What is your operator's name? Lan Hikari. Okay, Lan Hikari. Okay, you're on the list. Let me give you the author uh, the authorization data. If you take a PET containing this data on the courtroom foyer, the ID machine will automatically identify you as Lana Hikari. If you do not have a PET with the data installed, the ID machine will reject you, and so please exercise due uh, please exercise due care. Got it. Thank you. All right, we're good. There, I can get in now. <clears throat> Wonder if it's really okay to just walk in now. That Navi just now said that if you have the PET that has the permission data on on it, the security gate should should automatically let you in. It's probably okay. All right, I'll give it a try. Seriously? Yeah, nothing happened. Hey, it looks like I'm in. All right. Over her. Over her. Looks like you got permission there with no problems. Yeah, it went okay. By the way... Oh, sorry. This man is a prosecutor who's in charge of the case involving Aqua... Aqua... Uh, the, uh, blah, blah, blah. The Aquarium prosecu Prosecutor Ito. Ah, so you're the one who's testifying today. How do you... How do you do? I am Prosecutor Ito. Um... I kinda... I kinda know exactly... Uh, wait, I'm... I kinda know but what exactly what is a prosecutor. <laughs> oh, sorry. A prosecutor is basically a person who looks into an incident and tries to bring the culprit to court to, to face justice. That's what I do. It's important to job, and today's trial is one is is one part of my job. So that's what you do. Oh, I forget. I, I I'm Lan Hikari. Nice to meet you. Lan Hikari, huh? That's a nice name. Really? When you've been a prosecutor for as long as I have, you've heard a lot of names, and you can tell just by a name if a person is good or bad. I call bullshit. Lindsay, you're a good person. Or am I wrong? Well, when you put it like that, your parents gave you a very good name, you know? Come to think of it, your father's one of the top five scientists in the world, Dr. Yurichiro or Hikari, right? Oh, isn't that so? I didn't know that. 
I did. How do you know that? I ran into a little background check on you beforehand. It's something that needs to be done here before trial. Ah, but I'm jealous that your father is Dr. Hickard. I would love to talk with him, even for just for a little bit. Really? I'll tell you. I'll tell him that. You will? I was only half serious when I met him, but I never thought... I'm... Yeah, whatever. You two seem to have a lot to talk about. Well, we should really get on to the trial. Ah, that's true. I'm sorry. Speaking of that, this is your first time here, right, Lan? I think you should take a look around the, the courtroom. I think you'll be surprised by what you see in there. The system here is really something else. The courtroom is right behind those huge doors. Hmm, special system sounds exciting. And with that said, guys, I'm going to go ahead and stop here. So if you guys like the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll be seeing you all in the next video. So thank you very much for watching. God bless you all. See you in the next one.